Northamptonshire Police, out for drinks this bank holiday, make the right choice. That offensive joke you were about to make, it only takes one comment to harass someone. Oi mate, have you got a license for that offensive joke? Thing is, it doesn't take only one comment to harass someone, does it? That's not the law. As Carl Hogan points out, harassment is a repeated pattern of behaviour. When someone repeatedly behaves in a way that makes you feel scared, distressed or threatened. Imagine if one clumsy, unwanted chat-up line that someone took offence to was a criminal offence. Half the young men of Northamptonshire would be locked up every Saturday night. You'd have thought Northamptonshire police would have enough real crime to combat, given that one neighbourhood in the area recorded more crime per capita than anywhere else in the entire country. A total of 3,305 crimes were committed in that neighbourhood over the last 12 months when compared to the population that works out at 360 offences for every 1,000 people who live there. But why concern yourselves with that when John down at the Dog and Duck wolf whistled a woman. Oh my bad, that is actually illegal now in the UK. Lock him up for two years. Northamptonshire police sees rise in number of violent crimes reported, data reveals. Sod that, right? Bill down at the Red Lion just told an offensive joke, sending the SWAT team. What's particularly annoying about this is that police keep being told not to do it but keep making fools of themselves on social media. The Home Secretary keeps reminding them that their job is not to police legal lawful speech. Yet they keep trying to do it. That is, when they're not busy descending on pubs to confiscate gollywog dolls. And what is it about pubs that they're so threatened by? An update to the Equalities Act introduced in February could even force pubs to display signs that forbid banter. Oi mate, got a licence for that banter. Banter bouncers would have to be hired to police drunken speech because workers will have the right to sue punters if their jokes are deemed to be offensive. Police in many areas of the country say they're under-resourced and too short-staffed to respond to serious crimes like burglaries. Last October, the number of total crimes recorded in England and Wales hit an all-time record high. A 12% increase on the previous year. But don't worry about stabbings, rapes and any of that stuff when there's drunken jokes to be stopped. <laughs>